Yo, what's up guys, my name's Hero Chow. Welcome to RuneScape, and we're gonna do something special here today. Um, I'm uh, doing a lot of GeoGuessr, and I figured RuneScape has a pretty big world. Why not play a GeoGuessr in a game? So a game in a game, and that's what we're gonna do today. I've asked my friends and family to give me, give me some uh, challenges to do, and I've gotten them. So we're gonna do those, and first off I wanna say, Happy holidays, because that's that's going around these days. So happy holidays, and let's get into the game. So I've got a few pictures, and I will show you a picture right now. And this is the one that I've gotten, and this is the one we're gonna play with. First off, this is the first challenge. I'm gonna do ten, ten or five. Just gotta see how much we can we can do in one episode and how long it's gonna take. So first off, this is the picture I got, and I've gotten a map picture as well, but that's not opened yet. So I have to figure out where this is, and I think I'll just travel there and see if we can get either the same picture or we're, we're gonna look at this at least. And uh, first off, I'm thinking the blue roofs is really a Falador thing. However, there are no cows in Falador, so I'm not quite sure what's the roof color in Farrakh right now. So I want to go check that out actually. So let's move on to Farrock. So that's the idea. I'm going to go to the place where the picture is taken. And then later on we're going to figure out how many points we get. I'm not quite sure how to do the points yet. I think I'm going to go for a thousand around. And then we just have to figure out what's going to be the penalty uh, if I'm not on point. So, Farrock isn't the right color of the houses. No, that's more white. So I am gonna go to Falador because that's a smarter thing right now. Because the house colors, the roof colors are much bluer there. I'm quite sure of that. There we go. So the blue color of the houses. So I'm thinking it might be near the south. So we're just gonna move there and we're gonna see if we can recreate the same picture and or at least get as close as possible and then yeah we're just gonna have a point system and that's it i'm hoping this will be fun at least at least for the players who play runescape as well because you can figure out where it is together with me and send me pictures i will show you how to send the pictures later on uh, now, however, we're just gonna find this. I'm thinking here because I see a cow here. So, we have a few cows. This is the entrance, which I see right here. This is pretty much it, I think. So I'm gonna guess that the picture was taken right here. And yes, I play a female character. Anyways, I think the, <laughs> the picture is taken right here. So this is the point we're gonna place on the map. And we're gonna figure out how much point it is later on. So let's move on to the next picture, which is this one. Oh boy, oh boy, this one. Um, looking at the roofs again, I'm thinking either Karamia or maybe Yanil. Just want to check out your nail real quick. We got a nice little teleport to there, and I think this one might get a little bit difficult to be honest. I'm not quite sure. Yeah, the roofs look okay. The roofs do look okay. So we still are gonna have to figure out where this is, though. Um, there's a big house with shutters and there's a smaller house right next to it kind of awkwardly placed the trees look pretty much okay um, the roofs do look okay however I mm. <laughs> oh crap this is a hard one Alright, I don't think it's here anymore. <laughs> How do the houses look in Ardone? Well, not in Ardone, but... Hmm. 
how are the houses here and they have a different color so it's definitely not here all right uh, maybe Karamia then so here we go on Karamia we have some houses I do think it's to the habitable part let's see there's palm trees here there are no palm trees here so I do think you was the better choice so we're gonna ba go back to you the houses do look different also um, which is Yanil again this one all right so we're gonna go back to you and we're just gonna guess it there I do think I'm gonna be wrong uh, we will see in the evaluation later on um, for now I do think this is the better pick. So I don't see the shut the, the the house with the shutters though. Um, I think that will break me down later on. But for now, we're just gonna say it's over here. I know it's wrong. I know it's not completely here, but I think it's close to here. So this is the spot we're gonna put on our mini map, and we are gonna move on to the next picture the third picture and I think what I see here it's the um, it's a little altar part with open open thing near our dome um, next to the boat so I'm gonna go check it out right there if that's not it I'm gonna have a difficult time with this one as well <laughs> it's starting out good <laughs> um, I'm going the wrong way uh, we can just go around. That's all right. Oh, wait a minute. This looks like the. Yeah, I think this is the one we had before. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> oh, look at my good farming. Everything's dead. Awesome. I'll get back to it later on. So, this is where the house is. I could have gotten the six H to teleport, by the way. All right, there should be an altar right here somewhere. Or did they remove it? That's a possibility as well. Uh, that's that. That's how they changed it, yeah. Oh, oh, that's the thing. I haven't been here for so such a long time. Um, you get things like this. This wasn't bigger altar. Oh boy, okay, so this is gonna be somewhere else. Looking at the house here, I, it might be Taverly. So let's, let's check out Taverly really quick. Okay, do we have anything in Taverly? Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Taverly, Taverly, Taverly. So, altar in Taverly with statues. Oh, quite laggy here. Um, maybe it's more to that side. If this is not it, I definitely don't know where it is. I will not know where it is. Let's see, we have a windmill. It kind of looks like the bank a little bit, this house here. But it's probably not. No, it doesn't at all. It's probably not. Okay, so it's not here. <laughs> that much I'm sure of. Um, where is it though? Huh. I don't know. Okay, I'm just gonna go make a guess real quick. And it's gonna be... <laughs> still doubting, <laughs> still doubting. It's gonna be... It's definitely not, uh, not here. Definitely not here. It's in this region. All right, I'm gonna go to Caterbury. And I'm gonna put my marker right there. I know it's wrong, I'm just hoping for a few points. And 
this is where I'll put a dot on the map, and this is where I'm gonna guess. So that's number three. That's number three. But let's go on to number four, which is this. <laughs> oh. All right, it looks difficult. However, I can see this mark here, right here. And I think we can find out right here. So I'm quite sure where this is. <laughs> I'm quite sure where this is. Um, this is on the lodestone of Port Serim. Looking at... I'm not quite sure how this picture is taken, but I think it's like this. Taking him out of the frame. And this is the picture you have. So I'm quite sure it's here. So I'm gonna put my marker on this dot here. And... We're gonna go to the next picture, and the next picture is definitely improved in us. So we're gonna go there. And let's see where improvedness is this actually. Alright. So in Priftiness we have a few of these pictures, and I see this deer picture, which is right here. However, <laughs> I'm not quite sure where this will be wait a minute isn't it this this window right here like isn't it right here yes I do think it is right here so I'm gonna put my marker right here right on this spot and we're gonna move on because I do think it's here so there we go, we did five. Uh, we actually did 10, but I'm gonna take five because it's gonna be too long. And I don't want it to be too long. So we're gonna check out how we did. And um, we're gonna check out how many points we got. So let's go and do that. So this is the map I had from my first guess. And this is the map we had from um, the one I've, sent, I've been sent. And we are pretty much on the same spot, to be honest. I, I have my map turned a little bit, but I do think we are pretty much on the same spot. Um, we might be a little bit, a few steps uh, too far to, to, to the west. So I'm gonna deduct two points, uh, which gives me a total of 998 points. It's about two steps, so I'm gonna do a point a step, sort of. So the first, it's gonna be 998 points. So picture number two. Um, how can I say this? This is Port Serim. Where I picked is Yanil. Uh, I couldn't have been much more wrong, to be honest. This is a world map. Uh, I got it open right here. This is the world map, which means I have picked around here and the picture was taken around here. Um, where, yeah, here. No. Here, sorry. So the picture was taken here and I was here. This is more than 1000 steps. So unfortunately that will mean I have zero points for this one. So yes, I could be more wrong than that, but it's pretty bad. <laughs> so we're gonna keep it at zero points and we're gonna move on to number three. All right, so for guest number three, we went for Caterby. And it was actually, looking at the picture right now, um, near the Ranging Guild with um, with the Wizard's Tower or whatever it's called right there, uh, which we can find actually over here. This is right here. So the picture was taken right here, and I have guessed here, which is not too bad, to be honest. Um, however, I do think there's about 150 steps between. Maybe even 200. So we're gonna go for 200. Which means there are 200 points of deduction. Uh, which means, in the bigger picture, we're gonna get 800 points for this gun. It's an average, it's a it's guess. Uh, I'm not quite sure how many steps there are. I'm not gonna fi figure it out. We're just gonna go for 800. And we're gonna figure out a better way to measure these things later on. Um, but for the first episode, we're just gonna do it like this. So that was picture number three. Let's see how we did on picture number four. 
So this is the guess I made for picture number 4, which was on the lodestone of Port Serene. Looking at the picture we've gotten, even though it's weirdly taken, it is definitely the, the Port Serene lodestone. So we're right on point there, and we haven't even gotten a stop, step wrong on this one, so it's, it's a perfect thousand points. So let's move on to the last one. Alright, so we have guess number 5, and number 5 we figured out it was in Prifton Us, and it was on the bridge. And looking at the picture we've taken and at the picture we've been sent, we've actually been two steps apart from where the picture was taken. This is due to the fact that they have, we have used um, the Eye of Oculus, uh, but it's still, it's still wrong, it's still two steps wrong, so I have to figure out a way to, <laughs> to take that into account. But anyways, we did pretty well to be honest. We did pretty well. So, from the 5,000 points we can get for this, we got 3,796 points. Um, which is pretty good for a first episode and which is pretty good for a pilot episode, I think. And we're just gonna leave it at that, I think. So, so what if you wanna join and send me a challenge? Well, it's pretty easy. You go to Mr. Farouk here. He has an orb of Oculus, which you can buy for 20 coins and which you can use to make the pictures. What you do is you gaze into the orb or you take a selfie or whatever. You find a nice spot like this, this market hole or something. You can even get away these two things. You take the picture and then you go out and take another picture of this map or of the whole scenario or whatever so we can figure out where it is so once you have those two pictures you can name them uh, picture number one and picture number one map so i can always figure out that's the map i shouldn't open that one i should open the challenge picture and that way i can do what you have seen in this episode and that way we can actually make the challenge work so a few restrictions please do not go anywhere near um, lock things which you need a certain level for or near questing locks like like the, the latest quest that's out a, a picture from there I will never guess that one nor will I ever be able to go there because I don't have full quest points so taking that into consideration go mad go wild do the things you want to do and uh, you can send these pictures to me by email and i will put an email in the description below i will still i still have to make it so i, I can't tell you what the email is going to be but that's how it works so you've seen me do it now it's your turn you have a moving picture so it's much more easy yeah? um this is my challenge towards you do you know where this is if you do leave it in the comment section and i will tell you who have won it so i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please leave a like subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this and I will see you all next time. Ciao.